In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to create your own school management system. So now you can see, check out in most videos, actually, they tend to show you how to only create just the front end of the website, what you're going to, your users is going to actually see, like what I'm having here. You can see this is a demo website where I actually designed. So in most websites, actually, tutorials actually show you how to create just the front end of this website. But we are not going, in this video, we are not only going to focus on the front end. We are going to design both the front end and also design also the back end of this website. So now you are going to have to, let's, before I we waste, let's not waste much of our time. Let me go up to through the website so that you get to know what you are going to be building in this tutorial. So now you can see this page. This is the front end of the website. So let me show you, you a little brief of how the front end actually looks like before I go into showing you how the back end actually looks like. Then we go straight into the tutorial so that will show you what we are actually going to be designing, how to actually come up with this design. So now you can see we have the website. This is how the website actually looks like. You can see we have our app how the website actually looks like you can see how everything is being laid down beautiful you can see all the animation on it you can see this is actually the home page of this website this is the first landing page every visitor tends to land first on the website now you can see we actually have some other pages inside of this website we have our staff you can see how this page actually looks like you can see everything laid down now you can let me show you another one we have about section and see the about section how everything actually looks like it's just like a build up of what we have in the previous home page you just try to create so now i'll be working okay this is that for the front end you can see okay we have my dashboard where you can actually log in to we have contact page my lord dashboard now this is where every user can actually log into the website as into the back end of this website either the parents of the student or the student himself or the teacher of the school so this is where they are going to the place where they can actually click and log into the website so now let me go into showing you the back end of this particular website. Hello everyone, you're welcome. This is Kingsley from Kingsbird Designs. If you're just joining me for the first time, please ensure you subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit on the notification bell so that you get notified each time I upload new video. As you can see, this is the back end of the website. In this school, I actually created in this bar, I created a sample of two students, two teachers, and two parents, also with two classes. So now I'll be working. Okay, now we have two. You can see from here, you come to teachers. This is where we are going to be adding all the teachers. You can see this uh, list of the teachers I've actually created. You can click here on this icon to actually view the teacher. The teacher's details you can actually click on it to edit or delete the teacher you can click here to add a new teacher to the all this now we have students we also have students here this is the list of all the students in the school you can click here to add new students to the school you can see we have parents you will see the list of all the parents we are having you can also add new parents here. So we have classes. Under classes, we have our classes, subject, subject mark, subjects, the marks, exam timetable. So let me walk you, just show you how everything actually is. You have classes, each of the classes. We have this class, you can add new class. We also have our subject. Let's check our subject. You can see all the whole subjects they offering in that particular school 
you can see all of them here and also you will see you can actually add new subject then you can see we have exams we have exams and see all the exams now i have created like two exams they are going to be writing and the dates they are going to be writing that exam you can add new exams here you can actually max on max you will be seeing all the like scores of every student now let me see i want to see mark of people student from primary one which of the exam this is the exam they wrote which is mathematics i can click on view max is going to display the score you can see i have one student yeah so let me go to you you see my timetable you can actually view create your own timetable view the list of okay the primary one timetable is going to you can see the list the timetable i we actually create i actually created in this tutorial so i will show you how to do all this so now uh with that timetable okay now let's move attendance you can actually check your students every student attendance or every teacher's attendance so also you can also create events you can also not click clicks and notify to notify either a student and uh students parents teachers just can create notifications for any any of them so you can also create a transport in case you the school actually has a uh, transportation you can actually uh, create these transport details here so for this every then this is the general settings where you got to set the your website and see for and see how everything looks like and see how you set your working hours this oh sorry i'm going to walk you through how to design all this how to, you can come up with your own school management system you can see both this school management system actually has both the front end and also the back end of the website so i'll be waiting for your feedbacks and based on the feedbacks i'm going to be getting with that actually determine how fast i'm going to be uploading this video if you want this video just hit on the like button and comment i want this video in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel to and turn on the notification bell to get notified when i upload this video and many other interesting videos you will learn a lot from all right guys i'll be waiting for your feedbacks until then bye for now Oh,